All right, you're not going to believe this. I'm here with my former teammate, Eric Burns. We played together in Oakland in 2001. Former Major League Baseball player, current analyst at MLB Network. He's been Forrest Gump across America, swimming, biking, and running. Started in San Francisco. He's here in Philadelphia. He's still got his gear on. You want to talk about how you've been Forrest Gump for the last, what, 50-something days? Uh, today was day 53, so basically July 22nd. Um, my family and I started in San Francisco. I swam seven miles across the San Francisco Bay from San Francisco to Oakland. Uh, biked probably about 25, 2600 miles to Chicago. Um, it took a little bit of some detours along the way. And then now I'm in the process of running to New York City. And today, like you said, I still got the gear on literally 15 minutes ago, we just uh, ran into the parking lot here in Philadelphia. So uh, we started a foundation, my wife and I, called Let Them Play. And it's all about kids and youth activity. 97% of kids no longer have everyday PE. Uh, even the school we went to today here in Philadelphia, they have PE just twice a week. 70% of kids do zero after school youth activity program. Kids are spending seven hours a day in front of a screen. Trust me, I fight the battle with this little guy every single day. And obesity rates since when we grew up in the 1980s have tripled. And and my wife and I came together and we're like, you know what, let's do something about it. So after baseball, as anyone who's probably watching this is like, how did this guy get into endurance sports? Well, I started with a small sprint try and just kind of fell in love with it. And it's sort of become my life over the past seven, eight years. And we decided to say, okay, let's use the endurance thing and visit ballparks in two like really important uh, parts of my life that obviously hit the heart. And let's use these things and basically deliver grants to different youth activity organizations across the country. And so tonight, Phillies have an awesome Phillies fitness program, and we'll be delivering the grant to them to support youth activity. I can't fight the bureaucracy. We can't fight the bureaucracy of the public education system that's slashing funding, slashing sports. It's sad. But you know what we can do? We can promote youth activity, and tonight will be the 18th grant we hand out. Unbelievable. So in order to get kids off the couch, you decided to run across the country. So you're one end of the spectrum. You're Swim, bike, get, and run, yes. Yeah, you want to, to get kids to exercise. It's a great cause. Unbelievable stuff. What do you think about your dad running across the country? I think it's good. It is. It it's is wrong. It is amazing. Take us through right. a day real He's quick. He's made for TV. Take us through a day. Who maps it out? How do you know where you're going? How do you decide whether you're running, swimming, or biking? On well, no, no, day? It's, it's not that. So we swam in the San Francisco Bay, bike to Chicago, run in New York. That's it. It's not, it's not, it's, this is literally swim, bike, run. Um, and every day is a navigational meeting that we have to try to figure out the best route. That's a, the, the biggest, the most difficult thing of this is the logistics. For example, we got caught, we're in, in Pittsburgh nine days ago, and we look at it and we're like, dude, we have eight days to get to Philadelphia. And all of a sudden, I had to figure it out. I had to average 36 miles a day. So the past two days, because and then we were dealing with all the heat, the heat wave, everything. The past two days, I ran 40 miles. And then today, it was just 23 into the ballpark. But we are able to get here, get in time to <laughs> just be able to come on TV with you guys and promote youth activity. And it's, uh, look, it starts in Washington. And you guys are the station for the Washington Nationals. I swear to you, if anyone's watching in D.C., politically, I don't care. I'm all in for whatever I have to do to help promote youth activity. Put me as your ambassador. It's, it's deep, deep in my heart and in my family's heart. And again, I, I'll, I'll do whatever it takes to get kids playing because not only is it a physical thing, guess what? That physical activity hits this, it hits the mind. And that's where kids benefit from the activity. You cannot, you cannot take that away from them, FP. Dude, I'm proud of you, bro. Thanks, bro. That's all the Love time we bro. got for Eric Burns. It's my buddy right here, it's my boy, Eric Burns.